was once was a perfect world where right. there was Eden, but you know Satan had his way, and now it's not. I don't want to speak negative, but uh -huh. like, you know how this world is. It's not as good as it was once was, and like True. problem with humans is like we got lots of knowledge, but because of lots of knowledge, we got life and death. But like. With that, we didn't just get life and death. We got arrogance. We got ignorant. All because right. now we have all this Tell knowledge it. about all these things. Now we think we, we feel like so many people that feel so superior to not just like they think they're superior to like other animals, and in, they even believe that they're like superior to other human beings. Yeah, it's because of all this knowledge, and with the knowledge brings ignorance and arrogance. Wow. Tell and because back in Adam and Eve, they didn't have all that knowledge, and so they they listen to God. Yeah, you know, because. God, God, it's easier for God to tell them what to do and just guide them and live in a joyful life because without the knowledge, even uh, because of the knowledge, there wasn't so much arrogance, ignorance. Yes. And, um, yeah, so, uh, basically the quote is saying how we always, we look to all these, like, worldly pleasures, like food and drinking and sex and whatever, but, like, that's only momentarily for that happens in that moment. Mm -hmm. That's the happiness that we believe that we'll be attaining. We think that is good things, but it might, it's not always a good thing, because, like, what if you're eating, like, I mean, it's good to eat, obviously, but like, it's great for food, it's great, like, all of it. but, like, what if you're eating, like, strife and, like, anger? Yeah. All right, really good? Like, all right. My mom always says this quote, there's this quote in the Bible, it is better to eat one small morsel with joy than to have a big feast with strife and grief. Oh, my God, because, awful. That's honestly, true. like... Food is great. It's better when you like. It's better to enjoy it when it's a nice, peaceful environment. Right? No, I mean, like, you can't enjoy food if your dad is like all like you know nagging and stuff. I mean, I, if I try, like, if my mom yells at me while I'm trying to eat, I just lose my appetite. So like, I can't eat anymore. Then, like, apparently, according to my mom, who's a nurse and stuff, there's like actual, like physical, like repercussions. Uh, rep what she said. <laughs> um, yeah, to like actually to eating food with like like not in a happy way. Like it affects your stomach, and you don't eat as well as like your stomach doesn't digest the food as properly. So don't be angry and have fights while you're eating, guys. I <laughs> okay, and so I'll just say one more quote, and then just like you guys can end it. It was the Elizabeth Elliot one, also in the gallery. Uh huh. Now we're not reading that. Okay, cool. <laughs> My mom doesn't want to read that again. <laughs> uh, so I guess I'll just end it here. Happiness is a great thing, but it's wrong, but it's bad if uh, it's in the wrong thing that we gain our happiness. It should always be okay. for good morals, and it's always a good thing in the Lord, whereas joy is always such a great thing to have. And because it's from God, and no one can take it away, except Hallelujah. you. Hallelujah, there like, you go. Not even Satan can take it away. Yeah, there you, you go. You can't, no one can take it away, you can only lose it. All right. By there letting Satan, by letting all these things into your life, and by letting all these pains and sufferings, and let, like, let it take it, letting them to take over your life. Wow. And honestly, the only thing, it can take your joy away. Yes. The only thing that can stop it is your joy. Your yes. joy can stop all the pain and the suffering. If you just let it, if you just look to God, and you just stop being ignorant, like, with all our knowledge, just like Adam and Eve was, because they, they, they disobeyed God, and, like, a lot of us, like, we feign ignorance, like, we think that we know things, we, well, sometimes we, we do know things, and yeah, sometimes we don't know things. <laughs> Tell it, beautiful. Yes, so, uh, that's just, I wanted to say, I just wanted to point out the difference between happiness and joy. I hope you're blessed with this scripture. Amen. Amen. Amen.